I'm, 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 I'm fucking stunned right now. I, Dude. And stunted. You need to unclutch your pearls. Oh! Oh shit, shots fired. I do want Kami to punch him in the face. Hello and welcome back. We have the last episode of The Bear, which is sad and exciting at the same time because I am ready to see what they have in store for us. I am bloody excited. I cannot wait. Uh, I went to go back to because I was like, Ice Chips, the episode Ice, Ice Chips in general, but the episode has been on my mind so much so, and I, I had just edited that, and I haven't edited the next one, that I was like, oh, I've got to go like quickly skip through episode 9 to just remember what happened, uh, because again, Ice Chips not leave in my mind uh and it, it, it like had the bar i was like going through disney plus and the bar through episode 10 was gone i was like i was like what's happened i was like have i watched it and forgot have i sleep watched it like what the hell is going on forget that mom and i both share an account and i was like hey watch the bear mind you i told her like a week ago i was like watch the bear it, it's really good and she's like okay she comes back to me, oh, season three was amazing. I was like, are you kidding? I was like, you just started it. How are you already done? God, she's flown through it quicker than I have. Um, <laughs> so at least I know that in good conscience, I haven't sneakily watched it myself. I don't know how that would have happened, but it crossed my mind. Other than that, I'm expecting fur funeral for the other place. I'm hoping for a bit of Luca. No, I'm just saying it, Will Poulter, if you want to grace us with your beautiful presence, I will be happy about it. Um, other than that, I'm just excited and nervous to see how they are going to end off this season. Uh, if you'd like to watch this full-length reaction or, you know, any of the episodes from all the seasons, uh, I have a link to my Patreon down below. Like and subscribe, that would be wonderful. Uh, and let's get into it. I did watch while I was editing this morning. Oh, while I was like doing a thumbnail or something. I don't know what I was doing. I watched like a chef react to scenes in TV and movies. Um, to like how accurate they are. And he reacted to a couple of different episodes, uh, like bits from this. And it was great. Have, have you making family meal? Yes, yeah, sure, sure. Oh, uh, a lot of amazing. Pressure. Especially roast chicken. I love doing a roast chicken personally. So, okay. Begin by wrapping it underneath the Pope's nose. The Pope's nose. Some would say the most delicious part of the chicken. Make a figure eight. You see that eight, right? Yes. And then just bring it back and push. Bring it back and push. With my thumbs, right? Against the wing. The I'm literally going to watch this before I do my next roast chicken. I will be tuning in. But our trade is cooking. Yeah. And, and that to me is, is such a profound profession. Oh, I love this part of people's lives in significant ways. So yeah, you never forget that. Fill the belly. <laughs> For us. So this is your first day. Chef. Chef. You'll have a legacy here in this. A legacy. Wow, there's such a there's such a talk about legacy. And just try to do a little better than the day before. Yeah. Give one percent extra every day. Till you're at like a million percent. <laughs> Nurturing our guests, we're even nurturing our farmers, our fishermen, our forges, our gardeners. And so just remember, right? It's Have all about nurturing. Of course. I like that. Cooking is, you know, to cook is to nurture. I've got Dungeon Master's Guide. I've got 12 sided die. Okay, DD. Where are we going with this? These stupid words. Dungeon Master. And this is- Hey! Bradley Cooper! What the hell? Interesting. He was in a, um, cooking movie too. What was that called? It was in that video I watched today. <gasps> oh, Luca and Calm. Wow, this is amazing. And this is also their, like, legacy. The legacy of this place. I love that Richie is also a part of this legacy. No one me, no one. Feels like we're in an aquarium. <laughs> I don't know if that's an insult or not. A lot of blue walls. <gasps> Luca! 
He's so tall. Actually, I think Kami is just a bit short. <gasps> oh my god. I ship them. Fuck Claire. <laughs> no offense, Claire. Oh, that's a combo. Those two? Oh my god. Mm. Oh my god. I'm happy they're excited you're back. This would have just flourished exponentially. Yeah, yeah. so you're saying that we would have just retired your jersey. This is what I'm saying. Yeah, exactly. Richie, you're perfect. Yes, because every second counts, bitches. <laughs> oh my gosh. He becomes like a kid, which I think is like the best thing ever. But can I ask you about the balloon? Was it always supposed to be apple flavored? <laughs> Chef chalk. Um, because I'm just thinking about, uh, oh. like, uh, the, uh, needles. Like, um, so with. <laughs> Are you a bit. <laughs> Are you a bit much of a person? I love this. You want to lead? No thanks, I'm retired. <laughs> of course. Go get him, Chef Jess. Chef Jess. I want to see more of Chef Jess and Luca, but Chef Jess for Richie's sake. Uh, well, yeah, but what was the um, idea for that? I mean, as I'm like... He wants to learn as much as he can. Yeah, you know what? I, I gotta, I gotta run. <laughs> sure. He's like, I don't want to talk about food. Let me go. Oh my word. I would talk to you. Why did I say needles so much? <laughs> oh wow, you were so suave at the other place in Copenhagen, was it? Oh lord, that's funny. I'd talk to him. Well, I would stand there, whether I'd get distracted in his beautiful face or not. You never know. Well, yeah, this is... This is a part of Kami's legacy. I wonder if these people are all like, like real chefs. I think that'd be really cool. Cause they had the bits, but I don't know what's gonna be real or fake. Like first dish that I'd fully made. And it was simultaneously the happiest, most fucking terrifying moment of my life. Hmm. I was staring at it from the past <gasps> all the way through the dining room. Oh my gosh. He's actually just a big ball of anxiety and I love it. Mine was cornbread ice cream. Mm -hmm. Working for this guy. That. Working for this guy. He. Oh my lord. This is so fun that they all know each other. Months and months of different <laughs> ways. It's like uh, why I became a- I just love this web. This web of legacy. Things you learn when you dine Oh no! <laughs> he's here. Is he real? Is he real though? He's been- he's been faked before. I'm not a restaurant. We get a bad review, I gotta cut the fucking string. Oh, don't you dare look at us. <laughs> this just, this doesn't even feel like it's scripted. Do you know what I mean? From what I've seen from um, Io in like uh, interviews and stuff, that just seems like she was reacting to a fun story. I also like that possibly she can be a part of her character. Like it weirdly made me feel like I've kind of earned my place there a little bit, mm. you know, or something. Well, I feel like there's also this. This feels like well, you know those like um, people, and they 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 all talk about their shared experiences. Like sh three chef, like eight chefs sit down for dinner. Because I was like, I want to throw a party every single night for the rest. Of Can you life. stop this looking at us? Wrong. You can't handle this. What if he's not as bad as your memories? Make you out to be? I love you. I love what you. about you that? I'm really proud of you. Yeah, really. Oh shit. I really love you. Take fucking hands. 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 I think Chef. Stress. Ah. Uh. Home economics course, and I made like a. I'm really sad. We didn't have home economics at my high school. I reckon I would have got a lot more into food a lot earlier if we had home ec. There's nobility in this. We get this to help amazing. people celebrate some of the most important moments of their life. Yes, and this is what Mikey was saying. For a few hours to forget about their most difficult moments. Oh. Like we can make the world- So what happens when I'm eating? Not my own food, <laughs> but others. World that is increasingly in need of a little more magic and every time I- It this feels like this season's like part documentary in the best way possible. Is, uh, in all the places I've worked, is, uh, people don't remember the food. Ooh. <laughs> it's it's the people that they remember. Yeah, and that experience. They 
I'm so grateful that you're all here and um, and thank you. Thank you. She's right too. A lot of good experience is tied to the people and the place. Like you remember the food was amazing, but do you remember exactly how it tastes? Not all the time, but you remember when you had a great experience, like with a person. Oh no, I'm getting hungry. Don't you dare. That looks delicious. <laughs> I love that Sid's just like, mm-mm, mm-mm, mm You right, mate? Mm. <laughs> no, he's it's not. Yeah. yeah. Really stirring it. Like in that one direction for the last 40 minutes. That's just a fucking asshole over there. Which one? Just a dude in the corner, just don't. With the glasses? Is he real? If it fails. Oh shit, from Empire. Yeah, yeah. he's a dickhead. Yeah, he's the yes. fucking worst and one of the best chefs in the world. That's crazy. He used to be one of the best chefs in the world. <gasps> oh, who dethroned him? Fuck face. <gasps> oh, God. Bastard made me very, probably, mentally ill. Dead yeah. inside, cold, never turns it off. Accomplishes more <laughs> by 10 a.m. than most people do in a life. Oh, God, Kami. Hates black pepper for some reason. I'll never understand, and... Really? Black pepper? Delicious. Calm. Carmen. Carmen? Well, you guys gonna Do fight in the bathroom? Do you think that's gonna end well? No! Probably not. Yeah, <laughs> I'm betting now. Yeah, but at least you two are having a good time. You're my new- a fun duo. Don't follow him into the- oh! Chef. Oh, hey, how you doing? Forgot so? Oh, fuck you. Yeah, he sucks. Okay. I always wondered what I would say to you. If I got to see you again. Yeah. What is going to happen here? Okay. Let's have it. Is he worth it? Fuck you. I, I don't I don't have lunch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's right. Yeah. He's gonna give like a really No, no he's gonna give generally some... being you, I think. Yeah. He's gonna give like a really good explanation, isn't he? He's like, I pushed you. Well, this has been nice. Okay. Still not these, huh? I expected more out of you. I think about you too much. A little creepy. He doesn't think about you at all. I don't think about you. No, we know. Why are you such a fucking asshole? How am I an asshole? Do you have half an hour? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Welcome? For, for, for what? Teaching you. No okay, case, chef, when you started with me. Oh. And you left an excellent chef. So you're Ooh. welcome. Hey, that was a compliment. You gave me ulcers. And panic attacks and, and, and nightmares. You... Oh, Kami. Yeah, I gave you confidence and leadership and ability. It fucking worked. Oh, Jesus. But maybe not the way to go about it. How about that? I'm, 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 I'm fucking stunned right now. I... Dude. And stunted. You need to unclutch your pearls. Oh! Oh shit, shots fired. I do want Kami to punch him in the face. My life stopped. That's the point, right? You got rid of all the bullshit and you concentrated and you got focused and you got great. Oh my lord. Well... It worked. But at what cost? At what cost? I'm gonna go piss now. <laughs> He's like, I really need to go. That was wild. Kami. Oh, darling. Maybe this will give you some sort of closure? Like, it's not gonna feel good now, and it might not feel good for a while. But eventually I think you can take what you needed from that. Both the compliment and the fact that he just sucks. Like, it's both of that. I think he did make you better, but he also screwed you over. And if you want to go punch him in the face, and in the dick, that'll be fine. Kick him while he's down. Kick him into the urinal. Okay, we, we need to stop or I'm going to get really violent. Just the bare things, you know? <laughs> Just chef things getting violent. Don't catch me angry in a bloody kitchen. Chef Adam, still uh, getting your fingerprints on everything? Oh, <laughs> a smudge joke. That, no one's made one of those. Oh, good. Uh, 
borrow you for a second? Sure. Oh, sure. shit. Yes, of course. We will be back because I want more of this duo. Love you. Love it you. is fun. Love you. I love you. But like, this is cute. Wow. Come on, let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> We going kick-ons? We going somewhere else? Going to a bar? Chefs hit the town? Oh, I mean, it's great everyone's gonna be having a good time. Yay! <laughs> She's having the party. Tea and mug. Oh, we're at, we're at, um, fucking... <laughs> we're at Sid's place. Oh, if the facts are here, it's a party. This is so fun. I hope Kami shows up. Oh, I was gonna say I wish Nat was here, but she got she got bigger things to deal with. Freezer and all our Oh my gosh! Yes, the frozen food. Is that caviar? Yeah. Oh my god! No, no. <laughs> She's like, I hate Salt Bay. Wait, this is so fun. I want chef friends now. Actually, no, I can just do this with my friends. This is an interesting cooking. It is nice to see chefs eat bad food. Or like, you know, frozen meals. I think it's really, it's, it's something good, it's something fun. Look at all their, their evolution, their legacy. The beef evolves with the city. Yeah, you got decisions to make, Sid. Will they keep us? Will they not tell us till next season? Um, can you take this? Like <laughs> She's like, I'm about to have a panic. Uh, uh... Oh, are we gonna get it? Are we gonna, she's gonna call him? Or is she gonna ring Carmen? Oh, I knew she was in panic. I hope Carmi shows up. Oh, it's, I mean, it's the, like the hardest decision of the ages. I really hope Carmi. Uh, it's like the, the opportunity versus, you know, the family in a way. Oh my lord. I feel like I'm gonna go into it. I wanna like, sorry, I've been, <laughs> I wanna like rock back and forth. Oh my god. Sorry, you have to see my pajama pants. <laughs> what happened? <gasps> Is it the review? The review. Computer, computer, Cicero. It's confusing, just brilliant. Cause no, that's simple, complex. This what? Talent? Wait, no. What? Give me the article. Give me the article. Article. You rat bags. Fuck you. Fuck you and all your to be continued bullshit. No. On the bright side, uh, if they bomb, Sydney has a place to go. <laughs> this, ep this episode was fantastic. It felt so right for this season to be the end. Obviously, we didn't get any answers, but I felt like that was always going to happen. We got to see the funeral, at least, which was, um, which was gr great, like, to actually get there. The, um, it is so annoying that we didn't get, um, you know, to find out what, what Sid does, the whole review, what's going to happen. Computer, you know, cold, Cicero cold, that is scary. We want to stay open, of course. Um, you know, and I feel like Kami getting to kind of face one of his big demons in this uh, episode was really good. Nat's faced hers and her mum. You know, we're all facing some demons here. Uh, you know, Richie and his ex, less a demon, more of like a you know, a thing that he has to overcome. There's a lot of uh, things, but I think overall this season has been spectacular. 
It has been cinema, cinematic masterpiece. It is amazing. I love the way they have done everything. Everything has been beautiful. Music, set, sound, acting. Like, all the all the parts of a show couldn't have been done better. I was kind of just in awe half the time of how brilliant it was, how good everything looked. Um, I don't... I'd like, absolute props to everyone that has worked on this show because I was taken through what felt like it was more than a show and it was an experience. I And I say that with the utmost of compliment. Like, I was on this ride and I was just taken along and it was amazing. It was so amazing to go on this, this journey. Um, and just the way they focused on everything was so interesting and creative and felt new and fresh. And even without the main characters, it still felt so core, like the bear, it was the show. Um, and I think that was perfect. And I love this like focus on legacy. Um, and you know continuing what you can give who can give to where what people bring how people affect each other there's also the thoughts on like food what is restaurant what is food what is chef what is cook what you can give to people what you can do food is nurturing you know you remember the people i love these so i think they're really interesting ways to to think about talk about and interact with this world and obviously it's a show but i think it's really good to, you know, think about it. It's just, I think it's amazing. I, I was just, I don't know, 10 out of 10 season. 10 out of 10 season. I, like, the first two seasons will always, like, The Bear in general is one of my favorite shows, I think. It has always been fantastic. Um, and season one and two, I loved for very different reasons. I think it, they were just great. Um, but they were great TV. They, like, they were up there in TV of all, you know, all TV shows that I've watched. They were up there, do not get me wrong. But this season was just elevated to such a level that was like part, it was like art. You know what I mean? It was, we went from TV to art. Uh, while still having that, I don't know if I'm just like going wild or anyone else thinks that, but there was just such this, I don't know, man, it was beautiful. It was a beautiful season. I loved I think everything about it, I think it was all done so well. I loved having, you know, episodes focusing on Richie and Tina and, uh, you know, Kami, obviously, and, and Sid and Nat. Um, and it was just, it was just an amazing experience. I hate that we have to wait to see how these uh, plot lines are going to move forward. I hate that. I hate that. And I, you know, I'm very mad at them for that, but to get to have like experience how good this season is if they're gonna you know produce like that again i guess it's worth the wait uh but for now i really hope you've enjoyed uh, i hope you're having a great day uh, i hope to see you in either something else um or the next season um but yeah thank you for watching